One of the most important parts of adopting a new pet is to ensure they fit into your lifestyle. You've got to make sure you have the time to accommodate all their needs, and some dogs are needier than others. So where do Rottweilers fall in terms of neediness and do Rottweilers do well alone? We're going to cover everything you need to know about leaving your Rotty alone without a hitch or a chewed up shoe. Before I move on with the video, I want to ask you a simple question. Do you want to train your dog for any basic commands like sit and stay? Do you want to stop any of the behavioral problems of your dog like pooping inside the house, biting, jumping, or barking? If your answer is yes, please grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him or her. The Secret Training Technique ebook is available for free only for a limited time. So go and grab it before it's too late. Link to the free ebook and training videos is in the description below. Big Rottweilers have bigger bladders. One of the first things to consider is how long your Rottweiler can go before they need a bathroom break. Bigger dogs have bigger bladders and that means they can typically go a little longer between bathroom breaks compared to small dogs with tiny bladders. In fact, most big dogs can hold their bladder for as long as 12 hours. But just because they can, doesn't mean they should. Rottweilers are eager to please and they'll do their best to hold their bladder even if it's uncomfortable. Not getting access to bathroom breaks could actually cause health problems over the long term including kidney problems, urinary tract infections, and even incontinence. In general, you'll want to take your Rottweiler out for a pee break at least every 4-6 to six hours to keep them comfortable and prevent any problems. But their big bladder makes them a little better at being alone compared to smaller pups. Puppies need more breaks and more interaction. Well, it wasn't always that way. Rottweiler puppies have smaller bladders and need way more frequent breaks. In fact, most puppies can only hold their bladder one hour for each month of age. That means a three-month-old Rottweiler puppy can only hold their bladder for three hours. But that's not the only issue here. Young dogs and puppies have a lot to learn about the world and it's your job to teach them. If your young Rottie is sitting in a crate or a small room for 8 or more hours a day they're left to figure out a lot on their own and the result may not always be what you want it to be. Socialization is also absolutely critical as a puppy and according to the AKC puppies develop at a fast pace, so there is a small window of opportunity when they are from 5 to 16 weeks old to affect positive development. If your puppy is spending all day alone, they aren't getting the key socializations that will help them grow into a healthy adult Rottweiler. Of course, spending some time alone is part of your puppy's socialization as well but it's important to ease into it. Does your Rottie suffer from separation anxiety? Separation anxiety is a complex condition that affects dogs of all types including Rottweilers. If your Rottweiler is showing signs of separation anxiety then you'll need to carefully manage alone time. While the symptoms can vary between individual dogs, it's most often characterized by destructive or anxious behavior anytime you leave your dog alone. Separation anxiety is a complex subject, and well beyond the scope of this article. While Rottweilers can show some clingy behavior like following their favorite people around the house, they're not any more prone to anxiety than any other dog. How to leave a Rottweiler home alone? Consider a pet camera. We've taken a look at some general guidelines to help explain how most Rotties handle alone time but it will vary between individual Rottweilers. The best way to understand how your dog will handle time alone is just to watch them by picking up a pet camera. If you see your dog pacing, whining, or generally showing anxious behaviors then you know that some things need to be adjusted. But if instead, your dog is napping away between chomping on their Kong then you're in the clear. Without getting eyes on your pup while you're away it's hard to know what's really going on and how well they're handling alone time. If your dog is using the bathroom while you're gone, a camera can also let you figure out what time this is happening so you can time your lunch break at work or pick the perfect time to schedule your dog walker. Ease them into being alone. Don't leave your Rottweiler alone for 6 hours right away if they aren't used to this. Instead, start small and work your way to leaving for longer periods. Ideally, you're always back before your dog gets anxious. Start with super simple scenarios like just leaving the room while your dog enjoys a meal. From there you can, slowly work on going further away for longer amounts of time as your dog learns that being alone is okay. 
Create a safe space. Many dogs safe space is their crate, but it doesn't have to be. What's important is that your dog has some place they can go that's quiet and comfortable. This might be a blanket on the couch where they like to perch and look out the window, or a crate in the bedroom. Ideally, you can puppy or dog proof this space as well so that they can't hurt themselves or damaged items in your home. Provide plenty of exercise. Provide your Rottweiler with plenty of exercise every day. These high energy dogs need around 45 minutes to an hour of exercise a day, including daily walks and playtime. Rotties who haven't had exercise will be more prone to stressing while you're gone and may have behavioral problems such as excessive barking or destructive chewing. Have someone stop by the house. Your Rottweiler's day will have to be broken up somehow. The easiest way to do this, though it isn't an option for some people, is to return home on your lunch break. Spend some time with your pup, give them a potty break, then return to work. Consider doggy daycare? Okay, it's not exactly the same as leaving your Rottweiler alone but doggy daycare can be an option if it's within your budget. Your dog will get tons of attention and have their needs met. They can also get some valuable socialization and meet new friends. Leave the music on. While you've probably heard of folks leaving the TV or radio on during the day, and that can help, studies have shown that music can actually reduce anxiety for dogs. Classical music has been shown to work the best but just make sure that whatever you play is calm and soothing. Closing thoughts. Overall, Rottweilers do pretty well with alone time. Of course, there are always special circumstances but with some basic training and a few good toys your Rotty shouldn't have any problems happily spending some time alone. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the secret training technique guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the channel Little Paws Training if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.